we have the Golden Tigers of Tuskegee back for their semifinal match. Hi everyone, I'm Hello. April Baldwin. Hello everybody, I'm Tony Kirk. Gabriel Smith. And now, the ambassadors of Oakwood University. Good luck to you guys. Good luck, good luck. Antoine Southern. Kenesha Bennett. Jennifer Miller. There we go. And ladies and gentlemen, this is the Jennifer of Jennifer's Fan Club. Let's yes, give it up for her. <laughs> it's my pleasure to introduce the moderator for this exciting match, Ms. Monita Bell, an alum of the Honda Campus All-Star Challenge. <laughs> All right, first of all, I just want to give a shout out to Oakwood and Tuskegee for making it to the semifinal round. Thank you. Woo! Yeah. And also, they are representing my home state of Alabama. So, Woo! Yeah. Yeah. All right, so uh, now we are going to get ready for the teams up here to play. So, I need everybody else to play inaudibly. Thank you so much. And uh, who won the toss? Oakwood. Oakwood, okay. So, that means Kanisha you will be choosing from Fascinating Physicists, Hot Topics, Thanks for the Memories, and The Music Men. The Music Men, please. Okay, let's go. Songs by Ashford and Simpson and Smokey Robinson are featured in the show named for what Detroit-based record label? Tony. Motown? That's right, and here's your 10-point piece of reason bonus. The ascent of what founder of Motown provides the story for the musical? Barry Gordy. That's good for 10. Gordy co-wrote several Motown songs, including yeah, what alphabetic it? Jackson 5 hit featured yeah. in the show? Is that the song song? Yeah. yeah, that's right. ABC. That's good for another 10 on 20. OK, Tony, you're choosing. Let's go Hot Topics, please. Hot Topics. The remains of a 19th century fort were recently found beneath what California prison, once home to Machine Gun Kelly and Al Capone? Kanisha. Alcatraz. That is That's correct. Hard. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. Convicted of corruption, Tracer. Tony yeah. Mack was removed from office in 2014 as mayor of what New Jersey capital? Trenton. That's good for 10. Embattled Mayor Rob Toronto. Ford managed to hold on to office into 2014 as head of what capital of Ontario? Toronto. Another 10. The Music Men. The Music Men. Celebrating its 10th year on Broadway is what musical set in Oz with music by Stephen Schwartz? Tony. The Wiz. Incorrect, can you take it? Wicked. That's right. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. What Gravity. force of nature completes the name of the signature song for Wicked, Defying Blank? Gravity. That's good for 10. Carousel, Pippin, Showboat. Schwartz has two shows on Broadway with an acclaimed 2013 revival of what 1972 show with magic to do? Pippin. That's good for another 10. Music Men. The Music Men. Broadway's current After Midnight is based on the life and works of what royally named big band leader and jazz composer? Kanisha. Duke Ellington. That is yes. correct. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. After Cotton Midnight yeah. is said during the jazz age in what Harlem nightclub? Cotton, Cotton Club. Club. That's correct. The orchestra for the show was assembled Winton. by which Marsalis brother, composer of At the Octoroon Balls? Winton. That's another 10. All 20. Hot Topics. Hot Topics. The first film to gross $200 million in 2014 was what action flick set in a world built of what toy blocks? <laughs> Tony. Lego? That's right, the Lego movie. Here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. Fight as a free running pilot or as a mech style walker in what just released respawn game for Xbox One? Titanfall. That's right, 10 points. In February 2014, who gave fans an album full of guest vocalists like Kendrick Lamar on Collard Greens on his much anticipated oxymoron? Schoolboy Q. All 20 points. Tony. Let's go fascinating physics, please. Fascinating physicist. X relativity. As part of their 1919 divorce, whose ex-wife got the cash from the Nobel Prize he won in 1921? Tony. Einstein. That is correct. Oh, and here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. Which ancient Greek is said to have run naked through the streets of Syracuse after he solved a density problem? Archimedes. That's good for 10. Archimedes was said to be most proud of proving that a sphere has two-thirds the volume of what other solid with the same diameter? Q. Q. We're looking for a cylinder there, so 10 on the bonus. Fascinating physicist. In the 1660s, which optics author worked his way through three years at Cambridge by waiting tables and cleaning rooms? Tony. Bohr. Incorrect. Can you take a Kanisha? 
Newton. That's right. It is. <laughs> I love Newton <laughs> for 10 points apiece. Much of Newton's curriculum at um, Cambridge was based on the 2,000-year-old ideas of which teacher of Aristotle. Alexander the Great? Aristotle. That's good. Newton had to leave Cambridge in 1665 as it yeah. closed for two years due to wet like disease this. that spread plague. across plague. Europe. Bubonic plague? That's good for all 20. Oh. Kanisha? Hot topics. Early in 2014, the Kepler Space Observatory confirmed the existence of over 700 of the exotype of what bodies orbiting distant stars? <laughs> Tony? Moons? Incorrect. Kanisha, can you take it? Black holes? Exoplanets. Planets. Oh, true. All right, let's go for another one. Kanisha? Thanks for the memories. Thanks for the memories. University marching bands were among those who interpreted what top trending video. It was what does the blank say? Kanisha. Fox. That's right. And this is our last question. Often taken with a camera phone, what two-syllable S term entered the lexicon for a pic snapped of the camera operator? Selfie. Good for 10. Whose selfie, surrounded by Hollywood stars, crashed Twitter when she sent it out during the 2014 Oscar telecast she hosted? Generous. Degenerous. Okay. Well done. <laughs> Indeed, it was quick. <laughs> All right, so we're giving you the points for that. All right, Oakwood, you're at 150 now. And we now have new players in the face-off positions, Jennifer and April. All right, so Tuskegee, since you're behind, April, you're going to be choosing from Mythical Beasties, Shared Names, U.S. Coast Guard, and View to a Thrill. Shared Names. Shared Names. Here we go. Two of Henry VIII's wives shared what first name? One of Cleves, the other Boleyn. <laughs> Jennifer. Mary. Incorrect. April. Anne. Anne is correct. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. Terrence Howard's character in The Best Man Holiday shares what first name with the director of Django Unchained? Quentin. That's good for 10. The Django actor who played Calvin Candy shares what first name with the Renaissance artist of Virgin and Child with St. Anne? Leonardo. All 20. Share names. Which Laker legend, Jerry, shares his directional last name with black educator activist Cornell? <laughs> Jennifer. West. That's right. And here's like your it. bonus for five points apiece and a five-point bonus for all three. Springer. Jerry is the first name of which talk Say show it. host known since 1991 for out-of-control guests? Springer. That's right, for five. Which Jerry is the Mississippi Valley State grad uh, who set what? 38 no, no, NFL Rice. records as a wide receiver Rice. Rice. in his 20-year career? Rice. Good for another five. In which Jerry is the TV producer of CSI and The Amazing Race? Brookheimer. All 20 points. Well done. Shared names. Shared names. Celebrity chef Puck shares what first name with the Austrian composer of The Marriage of Figaro? <laughs> Jennifer. Phil. Incorrect. April. Wolfgang. That is correct. Good and job. here is your bonus for 10 points apiece. Don was the first name of what creator and host of TV's original Soul Train? Cornelius. Correct. Which Don was a boxing promoter King. once known as much for his hair as for his athletes? King. All 20 points. April. Mythical beasties. Cerberus, Chimera, Pan. Which had the head and body of a lion, a goat's head on its back, and a snake's tail? April. Chimera. That's right. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. What B Greek hero, riding a winged horse, slew the Chimera? Bacchus. Bacchus. your answer. Bacchus. That was Bellepharon. What was the name of that winged horse? Pegasus. Good for 10 on the bonus. April. Mythical beasties. What giant crustacean turned into a constellation by Hera also names a type of life-threatening disease. Jennifer. Cancer. That is right. Mm -hmm. And here is your bonus for 10 points apiece. The reluctant Viking hero Hiccup and his beast begin their adventures in what Cressida Cowell bestseller, How to Train Your Blank? Dragon. Good for 10. Douglas, Wyoming declares itself the home of the jackalope, oh, an rabbit. antlered cross between a pronghorn and a jack what? Rabbit. Good for all 20 points. Jennifer. Mythical beasties. Mythical beasties. Alcide on True Blood and Haley on the originals are what kind of half-human creatures studied by lycanthropists? <laughs> Jennifer. Werewolves. That's right. Mm -hmm. Here's your bonus for 10 points apiece with no confirmed sightings. <laughs> Biologists dismiss as legend what spiny, goat-sucking creature of Mexico and the U.S. Southwest? Chupacabra. That's right. <laughs> Caribdis, cockatrice, griffin, which had the head and claws of a rooster? Cockatrice? Cockatrice. That's good for another 10. Clutch. Jennifer? A view of thrill. A view to thrill. Breathtaking, sea forever sunrises over the Pacific draw early risers to Haleakala Crater in what U.S. state? <laughs> Jennifer. Why? That's yes. right. Here's your bonus for five points apiece. On clear days, you can see up to 80 miles from the Empire it's State Building. For. So it said you can see parts of what four neighboring yeah, states? New Jersey, Connecticut, yes, Connecticut up there, Massachusetts. Yeah. Team, again, your answer? Go. New Jersey, uh, dang. 
Yeah. Yes, you got New Jersey five. for five. The other three were Connecticut, Massachusetts, and Pennsylvania. Oh, we had those. Peter Thrill. Peter <laughs> Thrill. Scandinavian skies in winter offer some of the best views of what atmospheric northern lights phenomenon? Jennifer. Aurora Borealis. That is right. And here's your bonus for five, ten points apiece. The Pampas uh, is some 300,000 square miles above the space, no, mostly in West Brazil? South American countries. No, no, it's called something else. Is it Brazil? I think it's Brazil. Brazil. Argentina. Oh, okay. What other pea Patagonia? area of Argentina is a vast desert, the largest in South America? Patagonia. Good for ten on the bonus. Get a thrill. Lake Louise and Lake Moraine offer pristine natural landscapes in the province of Alberta in what country? Jennifer. Canada. Yes, and this is our last question. For 10 points apiece, the top of 1,811 foot Victoria Peak offers views of Kowloon Harbor in what dense, bustling, special administrative region of China? Hong Kong. Good for 10. Aden, Laconia, Tonkin, 2,000 must photograph islands rise Tonkin. from Vietnam's Halong Bay, an arm of what gulf? Tonkin. That's good for all 20 points, and that is the end of round two. All right, so the score right now stands Oakwood at 305, Tuskegee with 160. We've got Gabriel and Antoine in the face-off positions. Gabriel, you'll be choosing from Heisman History in Mandela's Memory, Timeline, SciTech, and years ending in zero. Heisman history. Here we go. The most recent non-quarterback to win the Heisman was Mark Ingram, a running back for what SEC school? Gabriel. Alabama. That's right. And here's your bonus for five points apiece. Since Ingram's 2009 win, which two quarterbacks have won the award as freshmen? Winston. Winston. Archie Griffin? Team, your answer? Winston. Archie Griffin. Uh, Winston is good for five. The other was Johnny Manziel. Since 2009, which two quarterbacks have won the award as juniors? Cam Newton. Cam Newton and Tim Tebow. Cam Newton, Tim Tebow. Yeah. Cam Newton, Tim Tebow. Uh, Newton is good. The other was Robert Griffin III, so that's 10 total points. Heisman history. What technique for pushing away tacklers is demonstrated by the player in the Heisman Trophy? Antoine. Stiff arm. That's right. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. 1922, uh, 1935, 1947. No in which year was the first Heisman Trophy four. awarded? 35. That's correct. <laughs> Berenger, Davis, Davis, Woodson, a Bush. running back Ernie who Davis was the Bush. first African-American winner of the Heisman. Davis. That's good for all 20. Heisman history. What Big Ten school has had six different winners, but Archie Griffin won twice, giving it a total of seven trophies? Gabriel. Ohio State. That is correct. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. Houston, what Pac-12 school also boasts six winners, including O.J. Simpson and Marcus Allen? University of Southern California. That's good for 10. Trophy namesake John Heisman coached what Atlanta engineering school to a 222-0 win over Cumberland in 1916? Georgia Tech. All 20 points. Gabe. Mandela. Asserting education is the most powerful weapon to change the world, Mandela earned an LLB to practice in what profession? Antoine. Professor. Teacher. Incorrect. Gay law. Yes, law is right. Nice. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. A simple gesture <laughs> became symbolic of unity when Mandela first shook the hand of what South African president he succeeded? So just that's for him? Yeah. Yeah. The clerk. That's good for 10. Yes. Mandela's unification efforts included recruiting the country's rugby team during the 1995 World Cup, as told in what 2009 film? Invictus. All 20 points, Gabe. Okay? Mandela. Which Nobel laureate, Johannesburg's first black Anglican bishop, closed Mandela's 2013 memorial with a moment of pin drop silence? Antoine. 2-2. Two, two. Yes, it was a race to the buzzer for five points apiece and all five for uh, a bonus, sorry. <laughs> Which three former U.S. presidents Bush, attended maybe? Mandela's memorial in Johannesburg? Yes. Clinton, Carter, Bush. More information on Bush. W. W. That's right. All 20. Years and again, zero. 1930, 1960, 1990, a U.S. reconnaissance plane was shot down over the Soviet Union in which year? Gabe. 1960. That is correct. And here's your bonus for 10 points apiece. 1960 was the year four students from what HBCU organized the country's first prominent sit-in protesting discrimination? North Carolina a and That's good for 10. That sit-in took place at a Woolsworth, lunch counter Woolsworth. in what former retail chain known as the Five and Dime? Woolsworth. Uh, no, that's no. Woolworths. So you got 10. Stand, stand. All right, Gabe, steal your board. Mandela. Mandela. Market, Old Town, Parliament. Hundreds cheered on an 18, sorry, 89-year-old Mandela in 2007 at the unveiling of his statue in which London Square? Antoine. Old Town. Incorrect. Gabe. Market. Parliament was the answer. Are right, you still choosing, Gabe? Mandela. Let's go. Um, Years ending in zero. Years ending in zero. 
1910, 1930, 1950, which years saw the second meeting of the newly formed NAACP? Antoine. 1910. That's right, here's your bonus. In 1910, Daniel Beard Incorporated Boy what Scouts? male youth organization yes. of America based on Lord Baden Powell's English group? Boy Scouts. That's good for 10. <clears throat> Race riots erupted in the U.S. in 1910 after boxer James Jefferson Johnson. was defeated yes. by which black pugilist with the same initials? Johnson. That's good for another Years ending in zero. Underdog collegiate hockey players outplayed the Russians to wow the world in what Olympic year's Miracle on Ice? Game. 1970? Incorrect. That's right, it's 1980, and this is the last question. Here's your bonus. What late night ABC News show got its continuing name in 1980 with Ted Koppel covering the unfolding saga of Americans held hostage? Ooh, I like 60 Minutes. 60 Minutes. It was Nightline, no, a good guess. Okay, okay. <laughs> Who became Zimbabwe. the first prime minister uh, of the reconstituted state of Zimbabwe in 1980 and president in 1987? Mugabe. That is Mugabe, 10 on the bonus, and that ends round three. <laughs> All right, now the score stands with Oakwood in the lead. So Tuskegee, you'll be choosing first from Oops, Good Reading, with ING emphasized. She's in charge and taking stock. All right, here we go, Oops. What word or name containing O-O-P is or was? A unit of cavalry. True. Yes. An omission and a contract. Loophole. Yes. To bend or hang downward limply. True. Yes. The Rastafarian rapper behind Snoop. Yes. A film's outtake showing Loopers. the Loopers. Yes. Comedian Karen Johnson's stage name. Whoopi. Yes. Nice. To work or act together. True. Pass. Nah, nah, nah. An exclusive story reported by a journalist. Pass. Pass. Scoop. Scoop. The first WNBA player ever Swoop. signed. Pass. Swoops. Swoops. A pen for poultry. Pass. Pass. Scoop. Scoop. Okay. To work or act together. Cooperate. Yes. An exclusive story. Scoop. Yes. The first of you can be at, yes, a pen for poetry. Cool. Yes, well done. You got them all, so nothing to review. Excellent, well done. All right, Oakwood, uh, it's your board. What's it going to be? Good reading. Good reading. Given the author, and can I get silence back here, please? Thank you. Given the author, tell me what word containing ing completes their noted title. Shakespeare, the Tame. Turning. Yes. Tame. White, the once and future King. blank. Yes. Clutch. Terry McMillan, blank to happy. Ring. Pass. Marjorie Kennan Rawlings, the blank. Shining. Pass. Bradbury, blank. Something. With, yes. And Rice, the blank hour. Reckoning. Reckoning. Pass. Gaines. Dying. Uh, yes. You got it. Augustine Burroughs. <coughs> Running. Blank. Yes. Astrid Lindgren, Pippi. Long stockings. Yes. Hardy, far from Maddening. the Maddening. Mm. Pass. What? Terry McMillan, blank to happy. Winning? Yes. Marjorie Kennan Rawlings, the blank. Ring. Pass. 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 <laughs> Anne Rice, the blank. Reckoning. Pass. Hardy. Maddening. Pass. Madding. Marjorie Pass. Kenan, pass. Pass. Aunt, pass. Madding. Ha yes. <laughs> <laughs> Marjorie Kennan Rawlings, the blank. Mm. Shining. Pass. Oh, Anne Rice, the blank hour. Amazing. Cooking. Pass. <laughs> Anne Rice, who's the vampire? Marjorie Kennan yes, Rawlings, that's... the blank. <laughs> No. That was tough. Good job. All right. So, who can take this one? The yearling. That's right. Okay. Gotcha. And Anne Rice? The witching hour. You got eight for a total of 200 points and the win. 615 to 510. Congratulations, Oakwood. Great game, both teams. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, and for these amazing teams.